So, tell me your name. Paige. Your Paige. And Paige, what grade are you in? Your kindergarten. Wonderful. And what school are you at? Charlotte Hills. Charlotte Hills. Wonderful. Thanks for joining us today. So, tell me about your project. What are you guys doing? We are learning some stuff and playing it on the poster. Tell me about the project. The project is about what we learned. What did we learn? About birds. About mm. birds? Wow, what did you learn about birds, Paige? All kinds of birds. Wonderful. What are the birds doing? What are they doing in your project? They're coming back from Mexico. We're we're putting our bird feeder out to feed them, and we can see them. Yeah, what's the name of the bird that we see when we go out and have snack and we make our bird observations with our binoculars? Robin. We see robins, we do. And our project was mostly all about weather and then how the animals and the plants change over all the seasons, right? Do you remember what it's called when we were studying how the seasons change? Phenology, right? So we were learning about the seasons, how they change, and how the weather changes, and what the animals and plants do with that, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Paige, it's a very important project, isn't it? Yeah. And are you having fun, and are you learning a lot with this project? Yeah. So Stephanie, well, Stephanie, your name and what school you're with, and, and just give us a, a scope and sequence of the project that the kids are doing. These are kindergartners. Yes, so I'm Stephanie Nielsen. I teach kindergarten at Shawmut Hills, and our project was focused on wonders. So it was all about wonders in phonology, wonders in weather, wonders in our literacy skills, so making connections with writing and making connections with our books. Um, and we really wanted to get the kids engaged just in their schoolyard and making observations about the changes over the seasons. Um, and we also paired up with some of our fourth and fifth graders, so they were able to do some cross-grade level connections. We ended up doing a trash yard project where we became the schoolyard um, you know, caretakers with cleaning up the schoolyard. And um, overall, I think that it has just been very empowering for our scholars to notice what's happening in their schoolyard and to take care of it. You like that, Paige? And Paige says she saw lots of birds. Yes, so that was one of the things they noticed the most, and they were very excited to have actual binoculars to observe <laughs> the birds in the trees and them flying and what are they doing and where are their homes and habitats and nests. So. That was a great addition to the project, too. Wonderful. And you guys are all having fun. Yeah. Wonderful.